Just here to, to, to play, for play. I'm just here to play. That's it. I don't want to stay back at home or look at, look at the screen and television. In winter we're here, and under the rain we play. And the wind, when there is. <laughs> de Verdun dans la Meuse et puis euh, j'ai été du côté de Dijon, j'ai fait des concours. C'est un jeu qui n'est pas violent, ça fait un petit peu de sport parce qu'on marche, on se fait. Parce que c'est un jeu où on peut bah, oublier tous nos problèmes euh, quand on joue, on est là, on s'amuse et puis, euh, puis ça nous fait oublier le reste. C'est euh, ouais, sympa, moi j'aime bien, j'aime bien l'ambiance qui est ici en plus. C'est vraiment euh, un petit jeu sympa. De, de Jean-Claude C'est quelqu'un de très, très gentil, très sincère. Il se prend jamais à la tête. Il, ouais, ouais, non, il, il arrive toujours à rester très calme. S'il sent vraiment qu'il y a quelque chose qui ne va pas, il va préférer partir. Enfin, C'est vraiment quelqu'un que j'adore beaucoup. Ouais. I, I never play for, for, uh, for, for uh, money. Never. Poker, something else. I never play poker. I never play money. The reason why is because I don't have money <laughs> first. <laughs> Ouh, ça fait un petit moment, ça doit faire 5 6 ans qu'on se connaît quelque chose comme ça. Moi avant, j'habitais pas ici, je venais en vacances à Cannes. Donc euh, bah, je jouais tous les jours à la pétanque quasiment et c'est comme ça qu'on a fait connaissance. Et maintenant, euh, bah, j'habite ici donc euh, bah, on se voit beaucoup plus souvent. Uh, I start two and finish at five or six something like that. Four hours a day. And we have the all the place for us here and uh, some uh, um, a little bit of hole to play football now <coughs> oh it's a long long uh, story you know at 17 my father is a little bit disgusting with me and escape and i fall in love with the girl here police catch me i come to villefranche sur mer found a job there find a woman i leave this girl Uh, no, she leave me. <laughs> I move, I move, I move. No more to pay anything. I'm homeless. Uh, my wife is very sick, you know. Uh, two, 2001? How do you say that? 2001? The year? Uh, my doctor said uh, I have a uh, hepatitis. Hepatitis. Yeah. C. Yeah, uh, yeah. Because. He said maybe it's alcohol, maybe it's a drug, some time, some things. I say this, so it's a woman. I, I know she was sick at this time, but I don't care any precaution, you know, no kingdom. It's no condom. Kingdom. No condom. <laughs> and now I am obliged to go at the end of the month to see my doctor and he's going to try to see what we can do. But I, I'm going to say to him that I know that you can do nothing for me. I know that I'm going to die more quickly than some people else because I'm very sick from, from the liver. You say to me it's really wrong to drink because if you drink too much, you can die. And I say to him, if I stop to drink a bit, for me it's a bit, it's not a lot, I die too. Then what? What's the matter? Uh, she said she say I'm, uh, I'm very sick and uh, she knows that I, I had myself to drink. Ten years, maybe. Not that I don't care my life, but I'm not afraid to die. <laughs> In French, we say, Quand tu es mort, on te met en bière. That means la bière is also the beer, but also the coffee. The same name. It's a nice place now to die. <laughs> In the beer. No, uh, uh, I know that petting, petting help to me to stay to stay alive because I need people. Uh, I'm not alone in my in my flat, uh, and also to, I can drink a beer with my friends. You know, my friends don't have it. I don't have it. But the rest two balls for them, then that's two points. Then they win. Tell you that. 